Hey Saints, it's Sister with a Testimony and Hope on a Star, aka the Mount of Olives. We came by today to check the mail. Miss Hope's been getting mail every day now. It's pretty awesome. I came out the other day and I found a little prayer box in here. And it was basically perfectly addressed to Miss Hope. And it reads on this wise. In Romans chapter 15, verse 13. May the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace as you trust in him. So that you may overflow with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. I thought it was really cool that the Lord would leave hope a prayer box so that people can put prayer requests, comments, and questions in her mailbox. So we know supernaturally that the Lord can lead people to hope so that she, from a horse's standpoint sometimes, might be able to help somebody through a rough time. So saints, do leave your comments and your questions for hope and for the Lord and your concerns or just your comments below in the comment section. Miss Hope is ready to work on your problems and to pray with you. Miss Hope really loves people and she has a heart of service. So as we found our little prayer box today in her mailbox, it was just so cool because it was perfectly made for hope. May the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace. The God of hope, Abba, Father, the Anointed One, the Holy One of Israel, the Lord of Lords, the King of Kings. May our Lord fill you with all joy and peace. Saints, the joy of the Lord is our strength. And if we have joy in the Lord, even with things that are going on in this world, we're going to be like Hope, a horse. She's not concerned about tomorrow. She's not concerned about chaos and confusion. She's very happy just to do what Hope does. And that is being filled with joy and peace from the God that created her, the Lord of Lords and the King of Kings. Romans 15, 13. May the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace as you trust in him. Again, saints, you got to trust in him. Hope trusts in her creator. Hope is a horse, and she has it so much simpler than we do, saints. But if God knew that hope was going to be here someday ministering to you, he had to have put this scripture in here for hope. Right, hope? Right? Yes. As you trust in him, saints, think on that. May the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace as you trust in him so that you may overflow with hope. See, there's a reason that he fills you with joy and peace, saints. As you trust in him and you're filled with joy and peace, you're going to overflow with hope. Hope just happens to be named hope, but we know that hope has something to do with faith. Hebrews chapter 11, verse 1. Now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. Saints, as God fills you with hope today, as you become filled with joy and peace, as you trust in him, I pray that you will overflow with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. The prayer box is ready. The mailbox is ready to be filled. Saints, let your joy and your peace come from the Lord of Lords and the King of Kings and be filled with hope today. Miss Hope and I love you. We're praying for you. 
Miss Hope is a minister in her own right, and she is a glorious mount of olives. So it's sister with a testimony, and Miss Hope, we love you, God bless you, saints. May you be filled with the God of hope as you trust in him, as you believe in him, as you put your faith in him. I pray that you will overflow with hope and the Holy Spirit will flood you with grace and mercy and happiness. No matter how bad it gets, saints, if you're filled with hope and joy and peace and you're putting your trust and faith in the Lord, you're going to be okay. God bless you. We love you. It's Sister with a Testimony and Hope on a Star. Later. You've got mail.